Jamaica Wallace, didn't we have an appointment after school today? It must have slipped my mind. We have to talk about you turning in your homework. I told you. The fire alarm keeps going off in my building. Three times this week? I get busy. I forget. Last night, I just didn't do a good enough job. Would you like to show me your homework? I'm sure I can help you with it. This is really close. We can fix this. Yeah? For reals? <laughs> sure, we can work on it right now. There's a few spelling mistakes and just arrange some of the paragraphs different. Yeah. Fussy all day, I think maybe he's gonna fever. Okay. Thank you, Mrs. Benton. Mr. Clark, I, I can't work on my paper right now. I gotta go make dinner. I'll do it. You'll do what? I'll make dinner and you work on your paper. Oh. Okay? Okay. You start with that third paragraph. Okay. Hi. Okay. Where's the food? Dinner served. I'm trying to concentrate. Concentrate later. Dinner served. I tried like you said. I moved the third paragraph, and it sounds really good. OK, now, that's for you. And who gets the baby food? He does. OK, you're going to like this. This looks really good. What's he doing here? He made us dinner. You don't think I can take care of my family, Mr. Clark? No, yes. <laughs> Please, leave my house. I come home to find him in my kitchen, cooking for my family. This girl has a job to do. Miss Wallace, can we please not talk about Shamika like she's not in the room? I'll talk any way I want. Now, I send my daughter to school to be educated. I don't expect a teacher to bring school up in my house. It's called homework. Excuse me? She has too much of it to be babysitting all the time. Mr. Clark. Shamika has more potential than any kid in my class. Why can't you see that? How dare you? How are you going to tell me what I should and should not see in my daughter? I'm merely suggesting that you give her a chance. I'm taking my child home now. The white tornado here better not be teaching at this school when I bring her back tomorrow. Ms. Wallace, I can assure you, I will deal with the situation. Come on, Shemika. Please don't fire, Mr. Clark. He was just trying to help me, Mama. He was just trying to help. It's, it's OK. Please don't leave because of me, Mr. Clark. Wallace, wait. I'll meet you outside. Why are you doing this? You gave her these grand ideas, and this world's just going to crush her down. Okay. I don't believe that. She's just going to drop into our life, and now you know all about it, right? I just know she's a great student, a born leader, creative, intelligent. Shamika. My Shamika. Yes. If she tests well enough in May, I think we might be able to get her into Manhattan West for middle school. That's for gifted kids. Uh, maybe Miss Benton can keep the boys a little longer every day. Okay. Okay. 